Okay, so kind of getting this engine apart. It's also just got a mess everywhere here. Transmission. I'm gonna hope it's good. I don't know. I accidentally dumped all the oil out of it, just pulling it out of the car, but this is a crank. I do this engine. <laughs> and the uh, torque converter and flywheel too. And the other thing, whatever the hell it's called, I don't know. I can't remember right now. Just took parts basically the side. Yeah, I didn't affect none of that. I just picked the whole damn thing out of the engine. <laughs> Picked it all up by hand and yeah. I got two pistons out of here. They were pretty stuck in there. Honestly. And there's a lot of gunk in here. And I believe one of these pistons has actually got a chunk broke off. That one does. Some of these I cannot get to move. Actually, all these left in here, I can't even get them to move out of the engine from their position. So, it's going to take me a while to get them out. Especially the ones that are way in the bottom. <laughs> the engine will pound them all the way through. It's going to take me a while. But, yeah, I got a mess here. But it is all apart. Pretty much. The timing chain here kind of holds its shape. I've thrown it around a bit. But, yeah. Oh, I broke it. Okay. I think I didn't plan on reusing it. Still kind of holds the shape behind, besides that chunk down there. The rest of it still holds its shape. I'm sure there's some good parts here if anyone needs them, but I doubt it. I doubt they're any good, actually. I take that back. I doubt they're any good. <laughs> Starter might be okay. I don't know. Never tried it. But the bearings are not all scored up. I mean, yeah, this one's kind of dirty. But it's not all scored up. Or not very bad if it is. She's got 70,000 original miles, I would bet. 73,000 original miles, yeah. Judging by the shape of some of these bearings. Most of these bearings, actually. <clears throat> but I could be wrong. Had a blown head gasket, so two of the cylinders were full of coolant. For who knows how long. Everything else was full of rust. I did break off one of the valves by accident on the heads here. Let's move the other head. Yeah, it's gone. Took me a while to find a spring. Carburetor, I believe it's stuck. It was stuck. Yeah, it's still stuck. Pretty much. Well, it moves a little bit now. Soaked it with some diesel. Just dumped a little diesel in. <clears throat> Oil pan, that's kind of gross. It's a 351M. So modified. So all I gotta do now is get these pistons out in the cam. In the camshaft out. But that's gonna happen at some point. I'm currently caught on half the fucking rods in there. I guess just a back one, but oh well. Yeah, I got two pistons out. <clears throat> and a mess everywhere here. And then I still haven't got that one to run. I can't figure out the one at 300. I also have nothing really to put it in. <clears throat> I mean, I could put it in the car. But then I have to figure out how to make the transmission mount to it. Is that a four-speed swap? <clears throat> There's a four-speed bolt right to that one, the four-speed they got. Because that was all the four-speed and the engine was together. It'd be a truck engine came out of a truck and transmission i could do that I have to figure out a clutch linkage i sold the truck they were in anyways i don't know maybe it'd be a project maybe <laughs>